I want to use the reciprocal program, I'm going to start. So this is the RATS program, which is reciprocal EMG triggered stimulation. So clinically, I would use this with patients who I want to try and help to switch off their overactive flexors before they can activate their extensors. So I'm going to need the second cable to put this into channel B, remembering white dot lines up with white dot. So underneath, now for channel B, is the biofeedback. So I want electrodes on all of these. I'm going to have one on yellow and on blue. And I'm going to have one on the earth as well. So these are going to go on the forearm underneath. On the forearm underneath. The black earth can go anywhere. So I'm going to stick that further up the arm out of the way. And then on the top, I've already got into channel A, the yellow and the blue only. So channel A is a stimulation in the RETS program and B is for the biofeedback. So I'm going to click RETS, I'm going to go into the program mode, I'm going to go task training slow which is the most common that I would use clinically, click the forward arrow, I've got an activation threshold of 32 at the moment and deactivation of 28, I can alter that here or I can alter that during the program, A they might not be strong enough to get over the activation threshold in which case I decrease it. They may not be able to switch off enough to go beneath the deactivation threshold, so I would increase that. Going forwards, I want to preset the amount of stimulation they would get. So this is looking at wrist and finger extension. So I'm happy with the amount of opening. Then I would click stop. Next, to go into the program. So you see here, I've got the A activation threshold, D is a deactivation. So if I squeeze, detects the forearm flexors, they go above A, the device will then tell me to relax. As long as I drop beneath D, then the stimulation will come in. If I want to alter these thresholds, go to the side menu. So I've got A highlighted, I can increase A, if I highlight D, can decrease D. So now I'm going to press run. One. So if I work, relax. and as soon as I relax beneath the D, stimulation comes in to open my hand. One. So I work to pick relax. it up, and only when I relax and drop beneath the D. Does the stimulation come in? So if I were to take this into a task, say so pick up this bag of cable, then I would drop them out. So again, I pick them up, but not until I'm ready to drop them, place them down, with the stimulation come in.